of Galileo's inventions. Oh, Galileo? Yes, he, he, he's a very scientific boffin and, and always inventing things. And if you ask me, he's far too scientific and inventive. Oh, he's my cousin, actually. <laughs> he lives in a kitchen on the other side of town. He and Aristotle have never quite got on. Yes. <laughs> what does it say? Just a minute, just a minute. But... <clears throat> Dear Madame Curie, trust you are as pretty as always. Oh. <laughs> yes, go on, go on. How is Aristotle? Mm. As bumble-footed as usual? Oh, get, get to the point, get to the point, Madame Curie. I'm sending yeah. you the telescope I've just invented. Oh. There's a full moon tonight. Oh. Point the telescope at the moon and you'll get the shock of your life. Oh. Your scientific mm. cousin, Galileo. Mm. I wonder what he means by that. Here we are. It's all set up for you now, Aristotle. <laughs> Point the telescope at the moon, he says, and you'll get the shock of your life. <laughs> yes. Ah! Oh. He's right. I can't believe it. What is it? Oh, have a look for yourself. It's the most disgusting thing I've ever seen. Kendall's oh, cornflakes. Yes. Breakfast in a box. Oh, obviously, advertisers have taken over the moon. Oh, don't look, Aristotle. It is a cornflakes box. What? We can't see the moon with that thing in the way. Oh, goodness. You're quite right. Well, that box will have to go. Uh, I'll move it myself. Uh, it shouldn't be any trouble. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Aristotle, I've got a better idea. Yes. What? Why don't I mix up another batch of dynamite? Uh, no, 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 no. We must be more scientific than that. Yeah, we could eat the cornflakes. Oh, no. We'll use a machine that I invented. The pull. Huh? What? The, the pull? Good. Yes. Uh, strong knot. OK, everyone. Pull. <laughs> yes. Um, uh, 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 it won't budge, Aristotle. Uh, it's obvious science can't do everything. What is obvious, Newton, is that we haven't been scientific enough. It's no use just pulling the rope. My cousin Galileo ah, invented a machine to make pulling ropes a little easier. Galileo called it the pulley, and it's about time we used it. Well, why Galileo. haven't we used it before? Galileo. Uh, well, because Aristotle is jealous ah. of Galileo's invention. Oh. That's why. I, I'm not jealous. Oh. It's just that Galileo is always inventing things, yeah. and I get furious. Oh. <sighs> Aristotle. Oh, oh, all right. Get your pulley. Oh, good. Yeah. Yes. Ready, every boffin? Ready. Pull. Yeah. Uh, come on. Yeah. Uh, oh, oh. Uh. Galileo's pulley makes pulling the rope easier, but unfortunately, <coughs> it's still not moving the box, Madame Curie. <laughs> oh. I don't understand it. 
It's one of Galileo's best inventions. <laughs> it doesn't work! It doesn't work! It doesn't work! Just wait until I write to Galileo about this! <laughs> but Galileo definitely said a pulley made pulling things easier. He was most certain about that. Well, maybe if we used two pulleys, huh? that'd make pulling even easier. Oh, two pulleys. Now, come along, Echo. Let me show you the ropes. Okay. Note our amazing arrangement. A lot of rope and a number of pulleys. This will certainly make the machine more efficient and the work much easier. Hmm. <laughs> I bet Galileo would never have thought of that. Oh, oh, hang on. We don't even know if it'll work yet. But my calculations prove that it will work. <laughs> But we won't know for sure until we test it. Mm. Come on, Echo. Do you know, Aristotle, I do believe these two young things are turning into scientists. No fear. I just want to move this packet so we can see the moon through the telescope. Well, oh. prepare the pulleys. If you want to move something, a pulley is the thing. Get a wheel that is round And find lots of string One pulley's okay Two pulleys are great A number of pulleys Will shift a great way It's working! Yes, we did it! Yay! Oh, my word, we did! <laughs> and... Scientifically, too. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah, but I think we're a little too late. The moon's gone. Oh, yes. Well, Galileo's telescope. We'll just have to wait until another full moon. Meanwhile, we have a great invention to perfect. What invention is that? Put the deck chairs in, Echo. OK. Now, take the strain, Newton. Right. Good. When Galileo hears about my lift, he'll be the jealous one. But Aristotle, it's awfully heavy. Oh, don't be silly. My pulley system will handle the load. Now, are you ready, Newton? Yeah. Good. And lower away. <laughs> oh, no. Spiffling. Galileo's in for a horrible shock when I write to him about my latest invention. Aristotle, your lifts a total failure. Oh, no, 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 no. No, it's not. You see, haven't you ever heard of the express lift? Oh, oh. Aristotle. <laughs> Madame Curie. <laughs> If you want to move something, a pulley's the thing. Get a wheel that is round and find lots of string. One pulley's okay. Two pulleys are great. A number of pulleys will shift a great way.